You dirty dog. I know what you like, and you want to see more of it. I thought you were on the internet to hear my stories and hear my jokes, but no, you like the dirty, sexy stuff. So I'm going to give you exactly what you've been asking for in my last couple of videos. There you go. Get it all in, you little pervert. I know you like this. You like the silver. I know you're not here for me. You're here for the shine. You're here for the sheen. You little freak. So, if you saw my last video uh, on my main channel titled, I was cast on a Zendaya show, uh, I saw a lot of you popping off with questions and admiring the suit. And so I wanted to answer a few of the most asked questions and also tell you a quick little story I didn't have time to fit in the video. Now your first question was, do I still have the suit, obviously, and you want to know where I got it. Well, when I was fresh out of college, I had a performance contract in China, and the costume designer there was making custom tailored suits for $75. Now obviously a good custom tailored suit can cost anywhere from $500 to a few thousand dollars, so my buddy and I were like, man, I wish we had $75, but we, <laughs> we talked about it. And we decided, you know, it's a lot to us right now, but it'll be worth it in the long run. And holy hell was it ever. What a deal. We even gave the guy a bit of a tip. Well deserved. He did a great job. Now my last little update on the Zendaya video is probably the most interesting thing that I left out of the video. And it's just because I didn't have the time to fit it in. And it's a bit embarrassing. Because your buddy Alex was a real dummy. A real dumbass. I could have won a trophy for being an idiot that day. <laughs> Let me tell you what happened. There was another guest celebrity on our episode that played the ringmaster. It was Leslie Jordan. I know you know him. The quirky old man from Will and Grace, probably most famously. Oh boy, he was there and I just wanted to walk up to him and kiss his little forehead and say, can I call you grandpa? Well, I didn't. I missed my chance. In fact, I'm such a dummy that I forgot he was in my episode. In fact, when I went to make my cartoon last week, I, uh, I re-watched the episode of Casey Undercover, and I was like, holy hell, I was in a video with Leslie Jordan? This is unbelievable. I'm so lucky. <laughs> I've been in there for years, and I totally forgot. Now, that's bad enough, but it gets worse. You see, a couple days before I rewatched my Casey Undercover episode, I uh, was out to lunch with Pam. And wouldn't you know it, who walks in? The one, the only, the legend, Leslie Jordan. And I'm looking at him, and I'm like, I know that guy from some... Isn't he an actor? Don't I know him from something? And Pam goes, yeah, that's Leslie Jordan. And I go, isn't Leslie Jordan that lady from SNL? It's Leslie Jones, Alex. You dumbass, what are you doing to me? Can we just order our fish sandwich and get on with our day? And I'm like looking at this guy and I'm like, oh man, I, I loved his work and I wish I had something to say to him. Not once did it cross my mind that we worked together on Casey Undercover. I could have walked up and be like, hey man. And he'd been like, oh, I remember you. You had that silver suit. But I didn't do it. I totally forgot. And when I was re-watching the episode, it just blew my mind. The back of my head blew right off with embarrassment. So that is what this video is about, and I hope it has you excited for the next one.